Hey there, future network pros. If you're gearing up for the CompTIA Network Plus exam, you're in the right place. Today, I'm going to break down some core network security concepts that'll help you ace that test. Let's dive in. First up, logical security. Think of encryption as your secret code. It protects data in transit and data at rest. Whether it's emails zooming across the internet or files stored on a server, encryption has your back. Next, certificates and public key infrastructure, or PKI. Imagine sending a locked box with a key only the receiver has. That's PKI in action, ensuring secure communication. And yeah, self-signed certificates can work, but they're like using a homemade lock, less trustworthy. Now let's talk about identity and access management, or IAM. It's all about making sure the right folks have access to the right stuff. Authentication verifies who you are. Multi-factor authentication, or MFA, adds an extra layer of security, like a fingerprint scan plus a password. Single sign-on, or SSO, makes life easier by letting you use one set of credentials for multiple systems. Ever heard of Radius or LDAP? These protocols help manage user authentication and access. Radius is like a bouncer at a club, checking if you're on the list before letting you in. LDAP organizes and locates information like a digital phone book. Security Assertion Markup Language, or SAML, simplifies user logins across different websites. TACAX Plus is another protocol, often used for network devices. It's like having a watchful security guard at every door. Time-based authentication is key for added security. Think of it like a one-time passcode that changes every minute. It's dynamic and tough to crack. Authorization ensures you're only accessing what you're allowed to. The principle of least privilege means users get the minimum levels of access necessary. No more, no less. Lastly, role-based access control and geofencing. Role-based access assigns permissions based on job roles, while geofencing restricts access based on location. All right, that's a wrap. Understanding these concepts is crucial for your CompTIA Network Plus exam and your future career in networking. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more tips. You've got this.